Hello Scorpio, welcome to your weekly reading. So Scorpio, the messages are going to be for the month of March. They are general, not every message will resonate. Take what does and leave the rest. Definitely come back to see how much applied and the energy can definitely carry on beyond the month of March as energy is fluid. Um, this is for Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North Node, as well as Jupiter. So make sure to check your other placements as well and let's tap in. Spirit, give me some energy for Scorpio for the month of March. What is the energy? Messages for Scorpio for the month of March. What's the energy? What would you like for Scorpio to know at this time? Messages for Scorpio. What would you like for Scorpio to know at this time? Messages for Scorpio. What's the energy? What would you like for Scorpio to know? I have seeking and finding. Okay, bottom of the deck. Changing your mind. So for some of you, there could be a piece of information that you find out that makes you change your mind, makes you um, make another decision pertaining to a situation. Let's go ahead and tap in. And see what this energy is. Why is seeking and finding here for Scorpio? What's the message? I'm hearing tulips. That could be significant for someone. Tell me more about seeking and finding. Why is this energy here for Scorpio? What's the message? Why is seeking and finding here for Scorpio? What's the energy spirit? Why is seeking and finding here? Okay. Four of Wands and the Three of Swords. Yeah, I feel like some of you are finding out some disappointing news. I'm hearing devastating news. Um, this is definitely for some of you pertaining to a partnership, a connection, somebody that you share a home with. Somebody could be deciding to leave. Just to simply walk away, start over. Aquarius energy. Tell me more about the Four of Wands. Why is the Four of Wands here? For Scorpio, what's the message? Why is the Four of Wands here? Page of Pentacles. Yeah, I feel like somebody wants a fresh new beginning elsewhere. Somebody could be purchasing a new home. Yeah, Two of Cups to the Ace of Pentacles and the Hierophant. Somebody wants to commit to another energy. That's what this is. And I feel like by somebody committing to someone else is going to leave you or leave another person in the Three of Swords. Give me an energy for the Four of Wands. I'm hearing home is where the heart is. So this person could just feel more at peace with this other person or at peace with you, Scorpio. But somebody's definitely being left out. Tell me more about the Four of Wands. Why is the Four of Wands here for Scorpio? Yep, Ace of Wands. Somebody's starting over. Somebody could also begin um, be starting a new project in the month of March. A passion project. Tell me more about the Page of Pentacles. Why is the Page of Pentacles here for Scorpio? What's the energy? The Fool and the Star. Heavy Aquarius energy. Somebody's going to build with another person. <laughs> for some of you, this could be an Aquarius, but somebody's ready for the new... New beginnings, new opportunities, new home. For some of you, new job, new car, new, new, new. Some of you with the Three of Swords, there could be three significant events that happens in the month of March. Three things that you're going to receive. That's a very specific message for someone. I feel like the number three is definitely significant. Yeah, but somebody's going towards their wish fulfillment. Something's a dream come true. Somebody could also be in the process of purchasing their dream home. But this person or you have very high hopes for the future. I feel like you're going towards what's meant for you. You're no longer holding back or this person isn't. You're ready to build. You're ready to put in the word to take action. Eight of Pentacles to the King of Wands. Very action-oriented month for you. 
a lot of changes, but you're creating the shift or this person is. Give me an energy for the Ace of Wands. Why is the Ace of Wands here for Scorpio? What's the energy? Why is the Ace of Wands here for Scorpio? What's the message spirit? Tulips. Something is significant about tulips. The color purple. The tower. Yeah. This is going to be a huge shift for some of you. A major shock as well. Scorpio, your energy. So you could be creating this shock. Something could be coming out publicly online. For some of you, something could be being exposed. Somebody's in the Five of Swords energy. Somebody's very hateful. Somebody could be trying to bring this tower. Something has to do with public embarrassment as well. Somebody could be trying to embarrass you because you are walking away from them. Give me an energy for the Three of Swords. Or this could be your energy. Take it as it resonates. Why is the Three of Swords here for Scorpio? What is the energy? The Four of Cups. Yep, because somebody's been rejected. Somebody's going to be heartbroken. Somebody really thought they were going to have this Ten of Pentacles. They were going to be able to build with you. They were going to have an abundant life. Somebody was willing to compete. Like, win at all costs type of energy. Tell me more. The Two of Cups. Yep, somebody is going through a separation. For some of you, I'm hearing a divorce. But somebody's getting left behind in the month of March. Somebody's making a final call on the situation and they're ready to leap towards something else. Someone else they just want new. Tell me more about the Four of Cups. Why is the Four of Cups here for Scorpio? What's the energy? So this message is definitely not going to resonate for everyone. Seven of Swords. I feel like somebody didn't want to listen. That's what this is giving me. Tell me more about the Four of Cups. For some of you, somebody didn't want to listen pertaining to the person that they got into a partnership with or you did it. But something is being exposed. Tower to the star. Something is about to come out that's going to send shockwaves that is going to create this change. And it's finally going to give somebody the power they need to leap away from a situation that's really not for them. Somebody is being manipulated. And they're somewhere they don't want to be. This person don't even want to be there. Or you don't. Give me an energy for the Four of Cups. Why is the Four of Cups here for Scorpio? The Nine of Pentacles because they want something else. Somebody was um fake. Somebody pretended like they were stable. They had all their ducks in a row. They were very balanced. Financially secure. But they're not. Somebody is a, a fraud. Thank you spirit. Somebody either married. Got into a relationship with a fraud. Somebody lies all the time. For some of you. This is somebody that could have lied about what they actually do for work. Eight of Pentacles. Tell me more about the Two of Cups. Oh, give me something for this Nine of Pentacles. Why is the Nine of Pentacles here for Scorpio? What's the energy? Why is the Nine of Pentacles here for Scorpio? What's the message? Why is the Nine of Pentacles here? What's the energy? Seven of Cups. I'm telling you somebody's a liar. Somebody's a whole facade. Like, <laughs> this person, whatever illusion they fed you or fed this other energy, it was just that. False. Made a lot of false promises. Somebody's just a false person. I'm even hearing, like, mistaken identity. For some of you, this is somebody that could do fraud, try to take other people's identity. For some of you, this is somebody that's not really telling you or didn't really tell this other person who they truly are. It's a lot unknown. Somebody's a fraud. Give me an energy. Yeah, the moon at the bottom of the deck. Somebody has secrets. Somebody's mask is getting ready to fall off. In the month of March, somebody's going to be exposed. This could be happening online. Give me an energy for the Two of Cups. Why is the Two of Cups here for Scorpio? What's the energy? Why is the Two of Cups here for Scorpio? What's the message? In the reverse, King of Pentacles. Because somebody pretty much wanted to marry or get into a relationship for money. 
It was all about what this masculine energy had, or all about what you had. Queen of Pentacles for some of you. This is a marriage. And now somebody's in an honor sore stressing out because it's like, who did I marry? Like, I thought this person was stable. I thought this person was bringing a lot to the table. I thought we were going to be able to build together. But no, it was a lie. All of a side. Somebody was able to keep up a certain image until they got what they wanted and then once they got what they wanted that's when the mask fell off or that's what's going to be happening in the month of march somebody's going to keep something up until they get the commitment the ring the house whatever the baby and then they're going to take the mask off and somebody's going to see what they're actually dealing with who they actually got seven of cups a whole illusion a whole lie a fraud give me an energy for the two of cups in the reverse for some of you, this has already happened and somebody's going to finally be able to leap away from this in the month of March. Give me an energy for the, for the Two of Cups in the reverse. The Five of Swords. It's giving me somebody didn't even question. It's like somebody let down their guard. They wasn't even defensive with this person. Like they gave in too easily. And that's why this person got bamboozled. But I'm telling you, something's coming to light. Something could also be coming to light about a child as well. In the month of March with the page of cups to the four of swords. Somebody's becoming enlightened. King of swords about their decision and they don't like what they see. Somebody going is not going to like this truth. But the truth should set you free. The truth is going to allow this person to free themselves or allow you to free yourself. Give me an energy for the King of Pentacles. Why is the King of Pentacles here for Scorpio? March messages. Why is the King of Pentacles here for Scorpio? March messages. The High Priestess, Pisces energy. Somebody pretended like they had money, but they don't. Somebody really don't have it like that. Oh my goodness, you know what this is reminding me of? A reading that I did a while back where both people were lying to each other. Both people pretended like they were stable, but they were not. Or at least not as stable as they were letting on. So it's like they both bamboozled each other. That's what this is giving me. Like the feminine um, manipulated the masculine and the masculine manipulated the feminine. That's what this is. For some of you. But I feel like for others of you. Third party energy. Somebody thought that the grass was greener. They thought they had someone. That they could you know. Lock in with. And life was going to be green. They were you know. Choosing a very abundant relationship. They were going to build together. But the opposite is true. Somebody's making a decision here to go find their wife. That's what this is giving me. Somebody's literally, look at this. Look at this. Oh my goodness. Somebody's going to find their wife. Like, no, this is not who I need to marry. Or this isn't who I shouldn't have married. This isn't who I should have committed to. Let me go find my actual wife. Let me go find my spouse. Because this is not it. Two of Wands, Queen of Pentacles, Empress, the Lovers, and the Ten of Cups. This ain't it. Somebody's just a fake. It's phony. I feel like also with this King of Pentacles to the High Priestess, somebody's finally listening to their intuition as well. Tell me more about seeking and finding. Yes, yeah, seeking and find. Thank you, Spirit. Confirmation. Somebody's going to find their spouse. Give me an energy for seeking and finding. Why seeking and finding here for... Scorpio, what's the energy? Why is seeking and finding here? For Scorpio, what's the message? Seven of Pentacles. Somebody wasted a lot of time. That's what this is. Looking. Thank you, Spirit. Somebody kept searching in... The pinnacles they, they were looking for, the pinnacle that you were looking for were all, was already right under your feet. It was already there. But somebody kept searching. Looking out. In different territories. And didn't even know that it was right there the entire time. 
Somebody had already found their empress, found their mates, but they still kept searching. For some of you, this is somebody who could have felt like you weren't good enough, but they ended up with somebody who was fake. Somebody wasted too much time searching when God's spirit had already brought you in. For some of you, you've already passed this person by or Scorpio, this person has already came and gone. Give me an energy for changing your mind. We all have free will. Why is changing your mind here for Scorpio? What's the energy? Why is changing your mind here for Scorpio? The magician in the reverse. Virgo, Gemini energy. You know what? Somebody didn't manifest from a pure place. Somebody was being very vain and shallow. Changing your mind. For some of you, this person could have changed their mind when it came to you. Like I said, something has to do with you not being good enough. What things look like instead of what it is. I feel like somebody's learning a major lesson here. Somebody's having a perspective shift. That's what's happening or that's what's about to occur. Yeah, somebody didn't manifest from a pure space. That's what this is. It was being very manipulative. Somebody thought they were in control, but no, God's spirit is in control. Give me a final message for Scorpio. What's the energy? Final message for Scorpio for the month of March. What's the energy? The world. A cycle is done. It's over. It's complete. I feel like the lesson has been learned or is about to be learned and the cycle is over. Somebody took the bait and ended up taking the L. Or that's what's getting ready to transpire. Leo, Taurus, Scorpio, Aquarius energy on the world. So just be mindful. Or somebody should have. So stay true to thyself and real with thyself. Grow with me as I grow with you. Stay blessed.